Hi, I'm Jerry, and I work behind the scenes at Acorns and Threads. I take care of the email newsletters for everybody, and I'm the unofficial events coordinator. So anytime you come to the shop and you are taking part in something like Acorn Gathering, Spring Fling, Stitchapalooza, I'm the one that's always bouncing around. So today, uh, Janine asked me to talk a little bit about some of my favorite things at the shop. I am also the one that does all of well, not all of the over one stitching, but a lot of times when you walk through the shop, you'll see different models and I've adapted the pattern to stitch it on 40 count over one is my absolute favorite thing to do. I know some people call me crazy, but it's what I love. Um, I brought a sample today to show you. The other thing that I love is um, probably my favorite designer that I wind up stitching a lot of is Plum Street. So I recently finished this one. So that's 40 count over one stitched with uh, Tudor silk and this one's called Autumn U. I've also stitched uh, the one that you'll see in the shop behind the counter is Cinnamon Stars and that one's another Plum Street design. Um, uh, the other designer that I wind up stitching a lot of that you'll see models for is Satsuma Street and that's what I'm currently working on. I have a uh, Christmas piece that's not over one, but it is this. And as you can see, it's in the shape of a Christmas tree. It was originally charted to be stitched on perforated paper. And I chose to do it on 40 count linen with the called for DMC. So that one is called gold peace tree. Um, so the other part of when you stitch 40 count over one, you use uh, my favorite silk to use is Tudor silk. And I absolutely love it. I own every single color of it. And it's just, uh, Janine has all of them here at the shop. And I collected them by buying them five at a time once a month. And I just kept, there's a chart that you can get that has all of the colors listed. And I just would mark off the colors that I received. And then they would send me magically I'd find them in my bag the next five the next month and it was a really easy way to get my thread collection so that I had all of them to choose from when I went to convert from cottons or other uh, fibers into the Tudor in order to be able to stitch it over one. So um, let's see what else do I have to say I don't know really very much. <laughs> so I'm Jerry and I look forward to seeing you at a at a shop event soon, hopefully uh, in 2021. Thank you.